And if Daniel Radcliffe is ever in another one of those wizard movies, it should be called Harry Potter and the Wand of Ingratitude. <laughs> yeah. So J.K. Rowling says that Harry Potter stars Daniel Radcliffe and Emma Watson can save their apologies. So she's, she's had a little snipe at them. Nice. Uh, she suggested she won't forgive the actors for questioning her trans views. They did more than question her views. They, they really got the boot. Uh, Daniel apologised to trans fans yes, for her behaviour that hurt them. Yeah, he apologised to trans fans for Rowling's behaviour, for uh, any pain that Rowling's comments <laughs> have caused. I'd be like, I fans. made you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. like what Pizza Express would you be working in if it wasn't I, Well, you? yeah, like, I saw him in Equus. He was terrible. <laughs> and the whole thing was a strip. We were all waiting for him to get naked and they saved it. They didn't let us see it at the end of the first act like yeah. they're supposed to. And we waited for the little Willie to fly out. And then I was like, that's what we paid for? This kid's got no talent. Yeah. He's so lucky to have been in that film. So, and she was the, when those films came out, Emma Watson was the richest woman in Hollywood. The richest woman, she was like 17. And then she complained. Because she, you know, the thing is, I, I wish that, you know, JK would leave it alone. I, I'm mixed about her anyway, because the books are terrible. But I support her ability to, and, and right to say anything she wants. But they were just people that disagreed. Just leave it. I mean, I don't, but, I'm not, this, I'm not I mean, waiting for the apology. I know. Is something I know. Right to the heart. I mean, it's like, I know. we were talking earlier about the, the Catholic Church. It is like a, a religion that's, you know. It is, but they just, they just had a different opinion. That's all. And it was in well, the past. People have forgotten about it. It's more than that. I mean, it goes right to the heart of, you know, biological reality. No, I, how, how people are allowed to even see the world. And what's great now is that, you know, Graham Linehan, J.K. Rowling, all these gender critical figures are now being proved right. We've had the, the WPATH files. We've had the CAST review. Mm. They've shown that actually, you know, pumping kids full of drugs and hormones and, and maiming them surgically isn't always the best path for them. And who, who'd have thought? Who'd but be, be, a, be a good winner, though. J.K. Rowling just be a good, just be a bit more generous with the kids. Uh, they are, look, really? they are, well, for one thing, they are actors who are uncomfortable without a script in their hand. They can't produce or create anything other than their face on the screen. She can make a, you know, a huge amount of money on her talent. Hmm. I just think that she has more power than they do. No, yeah, but she should. And she's punching no, down no. a little bit. No, no, no. You, a little bit. Forgiveness requires repentance, and they haven't repented at all. They won't, because so. rich white people don't think they've ever done anything wrong but in the world. But they've got way more. They've got way more power than her, because they're on the, you know, what's seen as the right side. They're, they're on the side of the Catholic Church. She's, but Galileo. in the arts, she's wealthier than they are. So she, in, Galileo in the, was wealthy. He was still led in and shown the rack. In the boardroom, she has the power. I just think when, when creating things in the future... They will go to her. And, they, and these two are going to age. They're probably not well because they're well, little. Well, then they should have thought about that before they... they should, I agree with you. I think, no, I think that... Listen, I think they're well, completely she's wrong. The God. No, she's their God. Believe she's me, when I read that years ago, I thought, why are you doing this? Yeah. She's, she's, did, she's done so many favors for you. But, you yeah. know... And can I just say that we had the tweet up a moment ago, but it's slightly disingenuous of the Independent to say that the person she was replying to with her, her post had far-right hooligan in their bio. It was hashtag far-right hashtag far hooligan, clearly a joke. Yes, yeah, 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 yeah. And she just said, uh, Slebs who cozied up to a movement intent on eroding women's hard-won rights and who use their platforms to cheer on the transition of, of minors can save their apologies for traumatised, detransitioners and vulnerable women reliant on single-sex spaces. I think she said it very well. It's Boom. amazing that the Independent is still trying to smear anybody who has <laughs> of biological reality <laughs> as, as far right. Give it up, guys. You've lost. All right.